I'm here in Pickford in the Upper Peninsula where the Augury Sunbirds advanced to their first state semifinal in school history and they had to battle the undefeated Panthers. And let's just say Pickford had snow field advantage. Fans bundled up on both sides of the field as the Panthers and Wolverines prepared to face off in under 30 degree weather. First quarter, Panthers Jimmy Story powers his way in for a three yard touchdown. Pickford leads six to zero. But the Wolverines lost senior Ryan Schweiderson early with a pop knee and that was huge. Second quarter, Story writes a poem on this one as Sam Burton closes the curtain on that powerful catch and run. Panthers lead 36 to zero. Agre Sims fans want to come back. Less than three seconds in the half, Caden Zion throws up a rainbow and finds Xander Fortin just inside the end zone to get on the board. Wolverines trail at halftime 36 to 6. Third quarter story is looking for some purple rain, but Wolverines Fletcher Fortin patrolling the skies, changes directions, and makes his landing for the pick six. Augury is down 36 to 14. Wolverines keep clawing. Zion runs right and drops a dime to Ben Salgut before getting plowed into the snow. But the Wolverines fall short 50 to 20, ending their first ever playoff run at the state semifinal. Head coach Chad Zion was proud of his team's second half effort. And they put some pressure on us. Uh, whether I don't know whether it made a difference or not, we both had to play in it. But um, just a little bit off today, and it was just a little abnormal. It's about the first time all season we've seen it. But the kids played a great. You know, they played hard right till the very end. The Wolverines gave it their all on this field, and I'd just like to say congratulations, Augury Sims, on a job well done this season.